Good afternoon, everybody. Good Wednesday afternoon. Today's the January January 29th, and this is today's daily devotional. Keep your focus. Uh, keep your focus on me. I have gifted you with amazing freedom, including including the ability to choose the focal point of your mind. Only the crown of my creation has has such remarkable capability. This is a sign of being made in my image. Let the goal of this day be to bring every thought captive to me. Whenever your mind wanders, lasso those thoughts and bring them into my presence. In my radiant light, anxious thoughts shrink and shrivel away. Judgmental thoughts are unmasked as you bask in the unconditional love, in my unconditional love. Confused ideas are un- are untangled while you rest in the in the simplicity of my peace. I will guard you and keep you in constant peace as you focus your mind on me. We have four verses. First is Psalm 8, 5. You made him a little lower than the heavenly beings and crowned him with glory and honor. Next is Genesis 1, 26 and 27. Then God said, Let us make man in our, in our image, in our likeness, and let them rule over the fish of the sea and the birds of the air, over the livestock and over all the earth and, all, and over all the creatures creatures that move along, along the ground. So God created man in his own image. In the image of God, he created him. Male and female, he created them. Next is 2 Corinthians 10.5. We demolish arguments and every pretension that sets itself up against the knowledge of God. And we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. And last is Isaiah 26.3. This is from the Amplified Version. You will guard him and keep him in perfect and constant peace whose mind both in both in inclination and character in its character is stayed on you because he, because he commits himself to you leans on you and hopes confidently in you and now we read the word of god this is what proverbs 29 says this is what this is what the word of god says he, he who is often reproved, yet stiffens his neck, will suddenly be broken beyond healing. When the righteous increase, the people rejoice, but when the wicked rule, the people groan. He who loves wisdom makes his father glad, but a companion of, but a companion of prostitutes, quant, squant, prostitutes squanders his wealth. By justice a king builds up the land, but he who but he who exacts gifts tears it down. A man who flattens his neighbor spreads a, f- spreads a net for his feet. An evil man is ensnared and and in tra- ensnared in his transgression, but a righteous man sings and rejoices. A righteous man knows the rights of the poor. A wicked man does not understand such knowledge. Scoffers set a city aflame, but the wise turn away wrath. If a wise man has an argument with a fool, the fool only rages and laughs, and there is no quiet. Bloodthirsty men hate one who is blameless and seek the life of the upright. A fool a fool gives vent to his spirit, but a wise man quietly holds it back. If a ruler listens to falsehood, all of his officials will be wicked. The poor man and the oppressor meet together. The Lord gives light to the eyes of both. If a king faithfully judges the poor, his throne will be established forever. The rod and reproof give wisdom, but uh, but a child child left to himself brings shame to his mother. When the wicked increase, transgression increases. But when the righteous will look up, will look upon their downfall. But the, but the righteous will look upon their downfall. Discipline your son, and he will give you rest. He will del- he will give delight to your heart. When there, where there is no prophetic vision, the people cast off restraint. But blessed is he who keeps the law. By mere words, a servant is not disciplined. For though he understands, he will not respond. Do you see a man who is hasty in his words? There is more hope for a fool than for him. 
whoever pampers his servants from childhood will in the end find himself his heir. A man of wrath stirs up strife, and one given to anger causes much transgression. One's pride will bring him low, but he who is lowly in spirit will obtain honor. The partner of a thief hates his own life. He he hears the curse, but but discloses nothing. The fear of a man lays a snare, but but whoever trusts in the Lord is safe. Many seek the face of a ruler, but it is from the Lord that a man gets justice. An unjust man is an as an is an is is an abomination to the righteous. But one who whose way is straight I'm sorry. But but one whose way is straight is an abomination to the wicked. Oh I'm sorry, I'm gonna redo that again. This is verse twenty seven. And an an unjust man is in is an abomination to the righteous. But one whose way is straight is an is an abomination to the wicked. Wow. I guess I'm just going to say what I've been saying before. Get knowledge and wisdom. Listen to those people who've been around for 20, 30 years, whether you're married, single, whatever. Even, even, if, you're, even if you're in your teens, still hold on to that. Get wisdom and knowledge. It will never, ever lead you astray. That's my message for you guys today. Guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. Like, share, and comment, please. Uh, you can also hit the wonderful subscribe button down below and the notification bell to get notified of all that I post. Hit the bell twice. Guys, have a blessed day. God bless. And remember, you are loved by God.